Yeah. By the way, you don't get the feeling that's going to happen, right? Hey, Andrews is going to play the way he plays. Yep. Second and six. Gore. Lost the ball. The Falcons have it at the 44-yard line. O'Brien Schofield forced the fumble. That's one of the talking points we talked at at the top of the top of the broadcast was the Falcons want to get the ball out. They haven't done that in recent weeks. We had our meeting with the Falcons on Friday. Go, go. Thomas, the deep back, they give it to him. A tough yard. Down to the six on first and goal. Calais Campbell made the tackle. When you talk about the man coverage that the Cardinals are playing, it frees up a lot of guys to get into the box and get after Tannehill. And on the outside, if you're going to play man-to-man -man coverage, the receivers, all they need is you don't have to outrun those guys, but you have to fool them. And on that play, the big play, Hartline fooled Gay and put him down deep in Cardinals territory. Reggie Bush is back in the game. Play action. Tannehill sacked. O'Brien Schofield with tremendous penetration. And Tannehill had nowhere to go. A loss of 14. Well, I don't think the Dolphins believed how athletic the Cardinal defense is. Schofield sees the play fake and has the presence of mind and the ability to put his foot in the ground and recover from biting on the play fake and he's so f Miller who had an 84 yard punt return for a touchdown in the first quarter Dave Zastadil's punt Miller takes it at the seven and trying to swing wide but he's brought down on a good tackle by O'Brien Schofield one of those young linebackers who's got good speed got down to make the stop after a 48 yard punt he's going to bring it in Giants will hurry it up. Coming near side, Vereen, and he has nowhere to go. O'Brien Schofield just blew that play up. And Vereen is going to lose. So we've seen Odell Beckham involved. With Sam Bradford in his ankle, I don't anticipate that at all. The tight formation. The blitz coming. Jackson trying to go outside. And they stop him. Great job by the Cardinals defense. Ken Wisenhunt calls the timeout. Great job by him to conserve time. What a marvelous job by the Cardinals defense. It's about penetration. Who's going to move who? And watch here. The Cardinals defense, look at all the black shirts across the line of scrimmage. Steven Jackson has nowhere to go. This is a 30-second timeout. Second and eight at the 15. Mason was going to set that play 
First and ten. Spiller. Tripped up. O'Brien Schofield taking over as a starter at outside linebacker here in his third season. Well, Schofield's going to come from here, and nobody's blocked. He's unblocked by design. They just didn't know how fast he was. And if you can run down C.J. Spiller, you know you're pretty quick. Catches him in about five strides before Spiller can get in. Quarter begins with second down, and Morris only gets a yard. O'Brien Schofield on the stop for the Seahawks. Once again, Niles Paul on the backside, struggling as a blocker. Hand the ball off on the weak side, and Niles Paul has to find a way to block. First and ten, they come up the middle, they got Jones through. He's grabbed by Morgan and then slips away and then finally jumping on him, Kevin Williams, a gain of 11. For Maurice Jones through, it's a first down, it's first and goal to go. The Raiders at the seven yard line and a timeout. A timeout taken by Oakland and they are out. Their final timeout. You cannot try and tackle Maurice Jones Drew high. He's right here, he's just going to come out of the backfield. A little, bit, a little bit of a dump pass. Watch the first defender in here. I have a good play. Here you sit. Into their performance. Here you go to you. Second, second down six from the 39. Newton goes down. Credit the sack. O'Brien Schofield, the Cardinal cast off. Pete Carroll has told us a bunch of times that he wanted this guy coming out of Wisconsin. And Arizona ended up getting them. That's a deep drop for Camp Newton. And, and Arizona ended up getting them. And then they were obviously after a few years let him go. Pete Carroll was happy to get him here this summer. What a great job of just keeping his motor running hot. Ram the goose in Muhammad. Muhammad retired. And they've been trying to find another guy on the other side. They're using two other guys to, to take his place. Check down on third down. Had trouble with the ball that Stewart. Ends up only getting two. Thank you, Joan. Here is a third and 14 now coming up for Matt Flynn. Green was at his side, the rookie. Oh, and he's whacked as he throws the ball. Good pressure applied, and that time it came from O'Brien Schofield. How about that, Wisconsin Badger fans? A fourth round pick out of the Badger program a year ago by Arizona with the hit. We got a chance to look at Alex Green right there. He's going to have to slow up. Offensive side of the football. Running play, Winston, and he fumbled the ball. And Wisconsin's got it at the 32.
J.J. Watt and Jay Valai recovered it together after Winston ran into O'Brien Schofield and coughed it up. Good job by the captain of your defense, O'Brien Schofield, getting penetration, taking the blocker into the back. Jarring the ball loose, you're going to see O'Brien Schofield come up, get penetration, pat level, uses the, the offensive blocker. Pendy has a tackler and knocking the ball. You'll see Schofield right here. Watch him come up and get penetration. Watch his pad level. Pad level always wins. He's lower than Pendy. Woody Hayes always looming over. Six BCS bowl games in eight years. Oh, that's a good play by Schofield. It sure is. <laughs> he took down Pryor. The ball went out of bounds just about at the spot of the tackle. And now a late flag thrown. And we talked so much about this, the speed of Terrell Pryor, but Schofield just walked him down. The runner threw the ball out of bounds behind the line of scrimmage. That's intentional grounding at the spot of the foul to be forced down. Lost him down. I don't know if he threw that thing, Sean, as much as when Schofield threw him, it just kind of came flying out. Let's watch. Why'd you see Schofield just running him down? That's a great effort. Uh, maybe. He might have. A little flickage. Yeah, there was definitely a wrist flick there. 